So over an active today with Ian. Um, targeting the usual for spars raid, anything with fins basically. Uh, so we're gonna camp overnight tonight, um, <laughs> way up the loch. Uh, and just see, I think tomorrow will be a short day. It's a lovely day forecast for today, and then tomorrow is pretty windy. First time out in Etif for ages. Uh, must be about a year and a half since I had the boat out here. So, uh, rather out of touch with the place. First off, Fishing down the loch here, down towards our chatting. Um, three on. <laughs> just picking up loads of uh, dogfish. In the cabin making a bit of coffee you can see we're rather over overloaded well stacked full of camping gear basically it's not very heavy but it's pretty bulky it gets in the way a wee bit Couple of whiting, a couple of wee spar dog, but uh, it's not been fantastic here.
don't think one of the bearings is going. Not just going to make any odds to this. It varies between feeling quite heavy and uh, not feeling much at all. Uh, looks decent enough. Isn't it? It's got another line. Yours, I think. Okay with that, or you want a net? Well, the net's here anyway, if you want. All right. First one I've seen for a while. A good selection of spines. And Best, but zero flavor is gonna have me thrown back. Yeah, you okay with them or are you on? That's an unlucky whitey. Chomped to pieces. Basically. You want that front in this one? Right, there we go. It's not a bad one. Too much of a baby sausage making in that case. Also got a couple of shore rods with us today. Um, idea is we we fish a wee bit up the loch and then uh, set up the tent, camp overnight, um, but hopefully get an hour or two fishing in the evening just to see if there's any spot dog in.
More of the same, isn't it? Sausage supper, unfortunately. Well wrapped up, that one. I don't mind fishing in the dark, but uh, I'll have a get stuff sent up in the tent and then have a go off the shore. On this side, quite close in. We fished in it as well, in fact, we didn't catch anything in there. Little baby whiting. Just back at the tent now. Need to get this stove lit because uh, basically it's gonna cook our dinner. Just keeping stuff simple tonight. Uh, back to my usual uh, chicken chorizo pasta type mix. Uh, not very imaginative, but it does fill you up on a cold night. have to go work on my recipes this winter at some point. Just having a cast or two off the beach while I wait for dinner. Um, you can see the size of fish we're getting. Um, once you hit these size of fish basically that's probably all you're gonna get. Mm -hmm. So uh, Lose your bait. Mm. I'm quite happy to concentrate on dinner and let you in catch them. I think I'm gonna have to get some either better lighting or a better camera for some of the dark shots. It's not gonna show up very well, I don't think this. Yeah, it's quite cozy in the tent though. Don't really need the tent stove tonight, it's not really cold enough, but uh, I'm not complaining at it. It's still a fairly calm morning. It's a bit more of a southerly breeze. Uh, it's clearly going against the tide just here. I'll just pull the boat in a wee bit. Uh, just to get it out that wee run. Uh, Again, we had a visit from deer last night, the look of it. Um, so just along in front of the tent, really. The tent is parked right on the high water mark, so we were near enough getting our feet wet last night. You should eventually get to 30 or 40 feet. Mm. Yeah. 
throw these marks at the Nice big weed fish, I think. Find each other, isn't it? Oh, and a tiny, tiny, tiny fish. So I have to get pulling the boat in now, gonna get loaded up and head down the loch. It's turning grey and starting to rain a wee bit and the wind is picking up a lot too. So you can see me hiding in the cabin here whilst uh, watching Ian being dedicated to his fishing. It is pashing down and uh, Pretty damn windy too. So we'll give it an hour or so, a couple of hours here. Just call it a day, I think. It doesn't look like it's going to get any better. It's another wee doggy, is it? <laughs> 